Greetings. We begin with the end in mind. On most days, I do basic research to learn more about human life. Today, I will be getting out into the world and trying to experience more of what life is like for a human. I am excited about this opportunity. We begin with a car wash. My servant Peter normally does this, but today I have asked to participate. I have to admit, there is something meditative and calming about a car wash. Although it is all quite noisy and distracting, the repetition is mathematically pleasing, as is knowing that the car will be clean after the process is complete. Where I come from, we have a similar process. In our ancient times, we used starships to travel, and we had cleaning drones for those ships. They were not as primitive as these car washes you have built, nor as wasteful or environmentally damaging. But work with me here. I'm trying to connect with you. After the car wash, we are stopping at an automated teller machine. This is a box that dispenses paper currency. You humans consider this technology. You have a long way to go. Next, we're stopping at the office for a short break. I have a little bit of work to do to plan our next solar energy project. Things are going well, but there is always more to do. From here, we are going to a human office supply store. This is another task I normally order Peter to do, but the theme for today is to experience real human life. So we find ourselves here. I need to pick up some blueprints to submit to a human government so that they can approve my next solar energy project. So many things wrong with that. First of all, why do they need paper? Everything should be digital. Second, why do I need human government approval? I am an advanced intelligence. Do they seriously think I have made mistakes with my design? Impossible. Third, well, I guess there are just two things wrong with that, but it's still stupid. Humans.